All right, Ben. Well, they describe it as being their worst nightmare. The family of a little boy mauled by a dog is talking about the tragedy that took their son's life. Just awful. Four-year-old Benjamin Cobb was killed by a pit bull his family had agreed to watch. As Nick Monticelli reports, his mother tried to fight off the dog in their Hazel Park home. Good evening. The Hazel Park Police Department is still wrapping up their investigation, although it's kind of obvious what happened in this case. In the meantime, the family of little four year old Benjamin Cobb, there's no way they're going to get over this, but they are trying to shed some light on what kind of boy Benjamin was. I feel sorry for the family and I just like I say, I'm heartbroken. It's just it's so sad. The neighbors on this normally calm and quiet street in Hazel Park want to offer comfort, but don't know how. It's heartbreaking. I just, there's no other words to describe. I have a four year old grandson and I'm just about ready to bust in tears. It's so sad. Tracy Johns, who lives just four doors away from where Benjamin Cobb was killed, brought a sign this morning. We have, um, Little angel, prayers, love, rest in peace. Last night, just before 7, police got a 911 call from a 14-year-old girl saying her brother, Ben, was being attacked by a dog and her mother was trying to stop it by stabbing that dog. When officers got there, the pit bull was still attacking. They tased it and freed Ben, but it was too late. He passed on the way to the hospital. In a statement, his family says, no words can ever explain the depth of our love for him. This has taken an unimaginable toll on our family, friends, and those who knew our sweet boy. A kind gesture to help a friend in a time of need for a dog that was said to have never shown aggressive behaviors has turned into a horrifying loss for our family. We have learned that we are far from alone in our struggle as diligent and loving parents from all walks of life have suffered this catastrophic loss under similar horrifying circumstances. Now, after being tased, the dog ran from the home. It was later found by Hazel Park police officers. It was taken to a local veterinarian and euthanized. In Hazel Park, Nick Monticelli, Local 4. Hey, Nick, and during the attack, Ben's mother was also bitten by the dog. As she was trying to save her son, she was taken to the hospital for treatment.